If you want to map for Space Station 14 first, you're going to need a private server. There are two ways to do this. Number one is the easy peasy lemon squeezy way, and this only works if you're doing it for WizDen, and it doesn't work with any other kind of changes, only mapping. First, you need to go to this website, download the build, unzip that, and run robustserver.exe. After you run robust server, open up Space Station 14, click direct connect, and type in localhost. Then hit enter, and you're in. The other way is the hacker man way. First, you're going to need to download .NET 8, git bash, and tortoise git. Once you do that, right click in your downloads folder, and click tortoise git. Then copy paste in the source code of the server from the github. You'll then begin downloading the repository. Once you do this, you'll go into the folder and click run this.py. Make sure you have Python, by the way. Once you do that, go back into your downloads folder and right click the repository folder, then click open git bash here. Once that's finished, type in .NET run and then two little dashes project content.server. Then open up Space Station 14, go direct connect, and do local server, local host. Fuck! <laughs> Once you're in, go into the console and type in a ghost. Then type mapping. Then do mapping again, but with a number of your choice at the end. Make sure it's something big, like in the thousands, so that it doesn't override any other number. Make sure you remember this number, because it will be important later. You can now press B to open up this menu. You can also press F5 to open up the Entity Spawner, F6 for the Tile Picker, and F8 for Decals. If you press Shift 1 through 9, you'll have different actions that will allow you to build things faster than using the Entity Picker. Make sure when you're doing things with tiles that you take things slow, because you don't want to accidentally create another grid, because that'll be a pain to deal with. If you have the mapping actions on the left, go to Shift 1, Press 9, because that should be space, and that will delete any tiles that you click on it with. Remember that entities that use AI won't be able to be spawned directly. For example, you can't just put down Ian in the hops office. You need to use the hops dog spawner instead, otherwise he will not load on the beginning of the map loading. If you want to color pipes fast, first right-click a pipe, any pipe in the network you want to color. Next to its name, it will have its UID. This is important. Then open up the console and type in color network, the UID of the pipe, pipe, and then the hex color. This hex color is included down below. Honda Priora! Yes! Это Мистер Геннадий, он